Hello guys and welcome back. This is episode two. I'm Civic Dude and look at this. We're trying out a new texture pack. Uh, this one's called Cobblecraft. You can see it right here. And I'll put a link to the to the texture pack in the description below. Um, so let's get started. We left left off in our little hidey hole. And now we're going to go try and find our place that we're going to set up our base. And I love this texture pack, by the way. It looks really cool to me. So, you can see I've been doing a little tree farming. Very cool. And let's set off and go look for our place. Now I've got these cool mountains, but I think I want to go down there because I think that would look cooler. You know, to have the opening look out on this cool landscape. I think that would be really cool. So let's go check it out. And this is the first time I've used this texture pack especially for YouTube videos, so please let me know in the comments if the uh, if the settings are not too good, like this, the brightness and stuff like that. Okay, we're almost there. Okay. So like I said, I think this is where I'm going to start my base. If I can kind of level this out a little bit and make it a little bit bigger entrance. Flatten that cliff wall out a little bit. There's already, let me see if I can get in here. There's already a decent opening to work with. And I won't have to dig out as much. So, that's what I think we'll do. So let me get back here to the front. And give you guys one more look. Here's what it'll look like walking out. And I think that'll be pretty cool. Okay, well I'm going to get started doing some digging and I will see you guys in a little bit. And we're back. And you can see that we've cleared out quite a bit of space here. Flattened off the front here like this and started work on our new base. I've got the inside uh, lined with wooden planks and wooden stairs right there. Looks pretty cool. Um, next thing we're going to work on is moving all of our stuff into here from our hidey hole. Maybe add some recessed lighting in the root in the ceiling. And let's see. Oh, the first project we're going to work on is moving my modified piston door created by MC Crawl uh, that some of y'all may have seen in my other videos and we're going to be putting that as our door for our base so I'll see you guys in a little bit okay guys we're back and we're loaded up you can see I get my inventory completely filled and the most important thing we're taking with us this time is our bed so we can set our spawn. But we're going to make our first run over to our new base to drop off our stuff. And sorry if my voice is kind of monotone. It's very early in the morning and I am kind of tired. So you can see it's right down there. We're not too far from our hidey hole. Ooh, there was a nice glitch. Anyone notice that? I could, saw, I could see some caves there. I'll have to go exploring. And see what we can find. Dun, dun, dun. Okay. Now let's find our chest. We're going to drop that off first. And 
just kind of throw everything in there. I'll organize it later. Off camera because that is definitely not the most exciting thing to watch. Okay. And I'm gonna set down oh. Okay, so apparently you need you can't just set down beds on top of half slabs. Might be common knowledge to some, but it wasn't to me. So I'm gonna dig myself a little room. And why is it not working? Okay, let's dig this a little farther back. Hmm. Well, this is kind of weird. Maybe I need more space. Don't you just love finding out things while recording? Ah, there we go. Okay, so spawn is there. Nighttime is nearly here. And this is not good because I left my spawn. I just set my spawn or laid down my bed so I can't sleep through the night. So I'm going to have to just grab everything else and run for it. And we'll see how that works. What a view. I love this texture pack. Oh, I can't forget about my jack-o'-lanterns. Yeah, so I'm going to use these jack-o'-lanterns probably in the ceiling for some recessed lighting. Uh, I think it was Generic B did that, and it looked really cool, so I was going to do something similar. Something similar because it looked really cool to me. So let's just grab all this stuff. And we'll make our way back and try and set our spawn. Grab it? Yeah, there it is. Okay. Okay, that and these two furnaces. Okay. Now let's run. Run, forest, run. Pull out my sword in case I need to fight off some baddies. Okay, so far so good. And it looks like we've made it. And this will be my door for the night. So, let's sleep. Okay, so far so good. I'll catch back with you guys in a little bit. Okay guys, uh, so I thought I'd wrap up this episode with uh, something that everybody needs, and that's a good wheat farm, or a basic wheat farm at least. So I'm going to hollow out a lot of room right over here, and we'll get started on that. And if you notice, I did a little redecorating in this room. Looks a little bit better. So stick around, and we're going to dig, dig, dig. Here we go. There's only one assurance in this life, and that assurance is him. I am dead, but in the hands of eternity. All I know is that I must live. Breathe.
Okay guys, looks like we're all done here for the very beginning of our wheat farm. Got a basic fence to fence it off, a little gate to access it, to pick up the loot, the seed or the wheat and the seeds. I've got my water back behind the dirt there, which waters out these two rows. And actually it goes a little bit farther, but I only one of these two rows. So let's get to planting. And we'll call this an episode. There we go. And let me replace that torch. Make sure I have enough light. There it is. Okay. There we go. Uh, let's make, make it higher. There we go. Okay, guys. This looks like a pretty good start. A little bit uh, better on our base. And I think next time we'll try and tackle the front door piston style. And I want to thank you guys for watching and stay tuned for the next episode. This has been Civic Dude and I'll see you guys later.